When you think of the biggest names in martial arts history, names like Bruce Lee or Jackie Chan probably rise to the top. When it comes to cage fighting and mixed martial arts, another name rises to the top. 41 Action News anchor Richard Sharp takes us to Olathe, where a world-famous cage fighter is training law enforcement officers the art of jiu-jitsu. So don't use this hand to pull his arm. It's hard to see the threshold of pain that these guys teeter on. I want to bring his wrist. Tap on the shoulder is the difference between a broken bone time out, time out. or a teaching moment. Don't pull his arm across so tight. These people are learning advanced moves in one of the most physical forms of self-defense, jiu-jitsu. I can't go for the submission that I'm looking for. The man teaching them is a UFC legend. When you say his name. Hoisey Gracie. Whoa. Considered one of the most influential figures in modern MMA history. History. Gracie won the first UFC championships in the 1990s. He's broken records, won gold medals, and beaten opponents twice his size. I'm using this. Now, as part of his travels, he comes to Kansas to the small studio in Olathe. I want to roll him over all the way. Where he trains law enforcement officers. I'm a big law enforcement person. From several different departments, all on their own time. You don't have to be big, you don't have to be strong. Gracie Jiu Jitsu is great for law enforcement. No, you don't really Rely on punching and striking and beating up the person. It's all about control, submission, just subdue the opponent. Wow. So, but that's the submission that you're talking about. Yes. It also teaches them how to become comfortable with one of the hardest parts of a fight. As soon as you got the wrist level of the neck, yes. The distance that is less than an arm's length. People are very uncomfortable with that, but we learn to be confident in those situations. It's not just valuable training for local law enforcement. These are incredible self-defense moves taught by one of the world's best mixed martial artists. To come here to Kansas and train us, it's amazing for us. In Olathe, I'm Richard Sharp, 41 Action News. It doesn't take much.